Jet. <laughs> this guy. Some of He's the so many funny. antics that yeah, you'll see on the set here of Big Hi. Bang Theory. Hi, uh, my name is Kunal. I play Raj Kutrapali on the Big Bang Theory. I'm Simon Helberg. I play Howard Wallowitz. Today, uh, we're going to give you the tour of our set. Mm -hmm. um, this is uh, Leonard and Sheldon's um, apartment. Yes, where we hang out much of the time. Yes, exactly. This is the couch where we sit. Um, this is where I like to sit all the time. No! <laughs> Get it? It's actually Sheldon's spot. Yeah. We can't really sit in it. But when he's not around, we like to do things on it, you know, that... Sit near it. Sit near it, you know, worship it, pray to it. This is the kitchen. <laughs> We've uh, done a few scenes here, just... Uh, just hanging about. around. This is a savior, the fridge. Going to the yes. fridge. It's a way to break up any... Any scene we're having there, Any you need some movement, always send the guy who has no lines to go to the and fridge. And it helps and returning with a joke. Well, if only all the girls thought that. <laughs> Come on, we're going to show you the bathroom. This is my favorite part. <laughs> it's uh, actually... This is going to shatter your illusion. Yeah, this is unfortunately the illusion. There is really... We have no to dig bathroom. a hole back there whenever <laughs> we have. Yeah. This is the way to Leonard and Sheldon's... Bedrooms. Bedrooms, their bedrooms, sorry, which bedrooms. they build on other parts of the set. Yes. So it's all which... an illusion. You walk back there and then they cut and you're in... This is uh, Leonard's bedroom. This is Leonard's bedroom. Um, as Stocked with all the cool stuff that, that ladies like, like Han Solo, Chewbacca, and then there's, uh, what's his name, Vigo? This, Vigo is, this is Aragon from Lord of the Rings. Sorry, we're not all really nerds. Vigo Mortensen. And in this episode, actually, uh, there's a Lord, of the, Lord of the Rings episode. This is a Lord of the Rings episode. episode where a, we, we find the we one find ring, the ring. And, and it find tears out. us apart. It's the real ring from the movie, and it tears us apart as it does the characters of the movie. Gentlemen. This is the one ring. Mine. <laughs> That's the hallway that you saw. See, it's all hard. It's all oh, com combobulated. Yeah, combobulated. Uh, that, we'll that's we'll the show hallway. you the hallway. So, yeah. Um, what else is there? Penny's apartment. Yeah, this is uh, the, the sweetheart of our show. This is her apartment. This is where we want to be as guys. Always, yeah. We always want to spend time in this room because it, it gets us in touch with our feminine side. Speak and we get for yourself. Spend time with Penny. What? Yeah. I'm no, a very sensitive... Gets me in touch with her feminine side. That's, yeah. what, that's what we're after. I don't speak English very well. Um, so, and then that's actually her bedroom back yeah. there. This is a backdrop. She's got a lovely view of... This is Pasadena. Uh, Pasadena. Gorgeous, gorgeous backdrop sort of, of Pasadena. Nuclear plant or something. I don't know what that is. And but. she's uh, she's a big uh, fan of uh, stuffed animals like this. This one's Pookie. The stuffy doll, yeah. as we say. Well, I call him Pookie. All right. Anyway, I'm going to stay in here and... He needs his alone time. with Pookie. I, I got to nice. shoot a scene, so... Right, you go. I'm going to stay with Pookie. When he finds his center and his sh chakras, he'll, he'll join us. <laughs> this is my friend Simon. So yeah, uh, this is a uh, elevator. This is the elevator that, that does not, not work. Does not work. Day one. So we have to climb, climb stairs and stairs and stairs. You can see these stairs go to nowhere. We actually all have to get very intimate down here like this, and he has to hold my leg. That's part of my own, my own process. This is Mark Sandrowski. Mark, say hi to everyone. Oh, hello everyone. Mark, How are you? Mark is the foundation. Of this show. Of this show. Uh, and also the best looking director in Hollywood. Yeah. So, all right, thank you. Nice to you. Go, thanks. <laughs> awesome. Thanks. Very easy. Yeah, Very thanks. easy, by the way. Oh, I can get a soda now. <laughs> Ta da! So, this is the Cheesecake Factory where we pretend to eat lots of food. Um, this is a preferred table of ours. Yeah, we, we sit have here. used the booth a few times, but this is where we sit. And the food is real, obviously. Uh, but we don't really have time to eat it in this scene unless it's really good. Mm hmm. Enjoying your food? Yeah, it's delicious. We're walking towards a hot set. It's not just because these guys are on it. Uh, no. But, you know, kind of because of that. So the reason it's a hot set, because you're not really supposed to touch anything like this, you know, because it'll mess up the whole scene. You know? Someone just got fired for that. Yeah, That's how exactly. easy. This is called a fourth wall. It's when they have to shoot out towards this way because you know there's a the proscenium so, so you build this and it's like a movie it becomes like a little movie so i don't want to use too many big words for you but proscenium <laughs> i use proscenium yeah this is, this a is our cafeteria. cafeteria these are all the extras say hi to the camera okay. vending machine where there is a one button that you press and things will come out um for free and not like life 
Excuse me, can we get a ride here, please? Thank you. This is the way we get transported in between scenes because we don't like walking. Uh, we don't want to get too muscular on our legs because we want to keep slender on the show. That'll be it. Thank you. Tipper, you got the money now. This is how we do the Big Bang Theory. Thank you very much. You, but I got 25 for myself. Check it. Let's go see the wardrobe. This is where all the magic of this and this happens. Yeah. This is our wardrobe. And this is Mary Quigley. Welcome to yes. the nest. Yes. <laughs> and over here, you will see all of Rajesh Kutupali's vests. I, of course, have to have a separate enclave. He has an entire room dedicated to Wallace. This is how big his closet would have to be <laughs> if, if he had a closet. I'd say that's why he lives with his mom. He, does, he yeah. can't afford an apartment with this, with this kind of... Closet. But let's let's see where his belt buckles live. Yes, they live right here. Yeah, they're good icebreakers, you know, and it draws the attention right to the. <clears throat> and of course, uh, one of my favorites was the Nintendo. Mm -hmm. This is the one we used on the pilot. Yes, that this was first wonderful. established Woolwitz. It will be in the Smithsonian someday. I know it. And the infamous alien <laughs> oh, pins. Oh yes. That are always on the turtleneck, and there is a meaning behind them, which we will not tell you. Yes. You can try to guess. Well, oh, yeah, uh, occasionally really I buy the personal it. underwear yeah. for the cat. She gets a discount. Oh, yeah, wow. <laughs> yeah so. the biggest underwear in the world. Well, but, you, know, uh, you, know. you know what they say. Yeah. Um, yeah. Big okay. underwear. Something. Yeah, big underwear, big waist. Uh, so, yeah. Hey, guys. Hey, back to you again. We hey. change clothes. Change clothes. Change clothes. Got to put money since. Oh, oh Johnny. Johnny. Give me five, man. <laughs> cool to see you. Looking good and hip. Are you doing all right out here? No, yeah, tell us what's going on. Yeah. I wasn't lonely. I was lonely. I appreciate you visiting. Uh, yeah, oh, I could this. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh. Yeah, this is nice. Can I take a five? Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Please come back and see us again. I already hope you enjoyed our set.